Hello everybody and welcome back to Easy Medicine. In today's video we're going to talk about stomach rumbles. Where do they come from and do they indicate that you should eat something? Before I get into the video, if you are new around here, consider subscribing if you want to learn more about your body. Let's get into it. Along the complete gastrointestinal tract, so your esophagus, the stomach, the small intestine, large intestine and the rectum are circular and longitudinal muscles. These muscles contract and by this contraction push down the food, the pipe system. This is called peristalsis. And this is an absolute health condition and doctors check for it. If they do not hear peristalsis with a stethoscope, this indicates that something is wrong with the gastrointestinal tract. So, these rumbles are always there, but why do you hear them sometimes so loud? This is due to the fact that the sound waves that are created are absorbed by the solid parts, so the actual food. And if your stomach empties out completely after digestion, there is only a few liquids and a lot of gas left. This gas and liquids are pushed down the pipe and as they are resonant and there is nothing to absorb the sound, you can hear the classical stomach rumbles. Are stomach rumbles and being hungry connected? Well, the stomach rumbles only occur if you have eaten something and then the stomach has to work. It takes approximately 4-5 to five hours for the stomach to digest everything and then to empty completely to be ready for the next meal. And of course this can correlate with you being hungry. But the center for hunger and thirst are in the brain and they are not connected by sound <laughs> to the stomach. So these events are not actually connected. That's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. If you did, smash the like button and I will see you in the next one. Bye bye.